So this video is to help you determine if you have a leak in your pool and that you need to call a professional to get a leak detection done to help you identify it. Now, sometimes you may just have a, a, a basic leak at your equipment and you physically can see that. That's one way. But if you think it may be underground or you just can't find it, uh, one simple thing that you can do is what's called the bucket test. What we usually do is take a five gallon bucket and we are going to add, fill the bucket up a third to halfway, and then we are going to set it on the first step of the pool. Now, the reason why I add so much water is so the bucket doesn't start floating around. And then you're gonna also have a water line within the bucket itself on the outside. What you're gonna do next is you're gonna take a piece of tape or a marker and you're gonna mark on the outside of the bucket where your pool water is touching in whatever that level is. It's usually a few inches above the bottom of the bucket, depending on how far or how deep that first step is. Then you're gonna take the inside of the bucket and mark the line on how much water you put in there. Those two lines do not have to be the same. They can, remember, inside you want more. What you're doing is you're gonna let the pool run normal, and then after 24 hours, you're gonna check and see if there's any difference. If the outside of the bucket, which is your pool water, is still lowered, let's say it drops a quarter of an inch because of evaporation, if it is the same as inside the bucket and it dropped a quarter inch, then you don't have a leak, you're just losing water to evaporation. And there's actually charts out there that you can type in your zip code and it'll take your temperatures and what your weather has been like and it can tell you on average how much water your pool would lose in that area and that can help you decide if it's just evaporation. But if you notice that your pool water level on the outside dropped, let's say an inch, and you only dropped uh, a quarter or eighth of an inch inside the bucket after 24 hours, then you've identified that you have a leak somewhere. At that time, I would call a professional to come out and help you discover where that leak is. If you'd like to get more information and or reach out to us and talk to one of our professionals that would love to help you out, just click on the link below and somebody will get back to you.